Welcome back to another and making the manga reviews. See by title below, this is on chapter 192 of Shokugeki no Soma. And yes, finally this chapter um, is out, of course. Um, I was so excited to read this one, obviously because of the hypeness of what happened at the end of the last one, showing three people being taken out, three of the rebels being taken out. This one, yeah, looks like there's a lot more than just three. I figured they would show at least some of the cooking of stuff going on. It would have been pretty hyped and cool to see those. But instead, it's pretty much just like showing every single person being taken out. Like literally all of the rebels are taken out except of course four. Which are of course obviously Edina. Um, she ain't going to lose. They're not going to let her lose. Um, Soma obviously won the last time. And then the, the one, this is how I knew it was going to happen. I knew that... The whole thing between Takumi and Megumi going against Rindo, there's no way they can beat her. There's literally no way, in my opinion. The only way would be something weird and stupid or just completely out of out of left field, obviously. Because we know how Rindo is, you know? And yeah, I mean, she pretty much explains that the, the exam kind of thing, it doesn't necessarily mean they have to have a showdown kind of thing. Instead, hers is just, hey, if you make her say it's yummy, then you pass. To which she tried both Takumi and Megumi's dishes and they both passed thus kind of a cheap way to get out of the situation. I was really hyped for that kind of battle but honestly in my opinion there's no other way they could have done it where Takumi and Megumi would still be in you know not expelled. So that was pretty crazy to see that. Um, the whole beginning part honestly I have to say too and Edina was shown passing and then she went running and she's all like kind of blushing and her hair is all, all crazy because she just ran all the way there. Super excited like, Soma, did you pass? Oh my gosh, my heart. Like literally, if you don't know, I ship Edina and Soma so hard and I always like love the moments that they have when they actually show these kind of things. And like this one is a prime example of her worrying for Soma. She could have ran to figure out did Hisako pass? Did like obviously that's like the main person you think she would, is her best friend, or even any of the other people before Soma. She runs and rushes over to find Soma and see if he won or not. To which of course he you know, him being pretty much, oh, did you run here? Your hair is all messy. And she's like, huh? <laughs> oh, well, well, whatever. I assumed that you would make it all, you know, her soon to egg side coming out and everything. And I just swear, she is so, so adorable. That one, the first picture with her all blushing and everything, that was there. Like, it was adorable, honestly. Like, Edina, best girl for sure. But um, after that part, obviously, like I said, pretty much the big thing is, um, besides everyone else being expelled, is that. Hayama got expelled too. The terms of his agreement, like I was saying, I wonder what happens if there was something that happens when he loses. Of course, yeah, it ends up being Asami's, um, what's it called, his assistant or whatever, his aide, pretty much comes and says, yeah, Hayama is kicked out. He's expelled since he did not fulfill his agreement with everything. He lost to Soma, so he's gone as well. So Hayama's gone, and then right after that, he's like, oh, you want to know the results of the other people? Yeah, guess what? Every single other rebel is gone. Like, I expected, honestly, some of them to be taken out, but I did not expect, like, Kurokiba and, like, Atlas to be taken out. Like, literally, like, those two at least, I would have expected them to pass. Like, I did not expect them to be expelled. Like, holy crap. Not to mention, of course, you know, we had a bunch of, like, kind of foodgasm moments or, like, fan service in this chapter with them being, like, clothes torn off and everything. Yeah, thanks for that, as normal. Um, but holy crap, I did not expect all of them to be taken out. And then, of course, the two people I expected to be taken out, Takumi and Megumi, they're staying, obviously, because of Rindo and her, you know, her quirky kind of personality with everything. Hey, you know, we don't have to fight. I, if, if I say it's yummy, then you pass. And guess what? Obviously, she loved their food, so they passed. So, yeah. And then after that, also, it's as, as expected, Takumi would be pissed off. I expected Edina to be a little bit more pissed off too, but they showed more of Takumi being pissed and obviously Soma kind of being like, well, you know, he he's mad, but he can't badmouth those guys because considering they didn't lose because of underhand tactics, like for example, the other test before that, they lost just because they had to go against like the elite of the elite, the 
the best of the best, obviously, and end up being that they could not measure up against them. The only one being the fact was, of course, Rindo, and it's just because it's Rindo, obviously. So that's why Takumi Megumi went. But, of course, Soma comes up with his next crazy plan, and this is the thing that I knew was going to happen, and I knew, like, this is the only way that the manga could go, honestly, for them to stop this reign of Asami and everything. And that would be for them to, of course, take the, you know, the Elite 10 seats. And, of course, now there's four of them. So if the four of them are in it, they'll be able to, I don't know, like, he was like, they can override stuff and, you know, overthrow or whatever, something along the lines. But they can't because there's only four of them, even if they get in there, not five. I mean, you know, so... They don't have majority votes of the whole thing. So I don't know if like Rindo's gonna start to decide to side with them instead and there's their fifth, or because of the fact that maybe I don't know, someone else is gonna come and help them. I'm not too sure at the moment, because at the moment there's only obviously Soma, Edina, Takumi, and Megumi that's gonna be doing it. But yeah, like I said before, when the whole thing with Takumi, um not Takumi, sorry, um Soma going against Hayama and it was going to be uh, Shokugeki for Soma to take his seat and everything. I knew that that was the only way for them to go along with the story and honestly as you can see this is the only way and it's gonna be honestly in my opinion pr I'm pretty hyped to see what's gonna happen like I did not expect everyone to be taken out in this one chapter honestly and uh, the people to be remaining obviously besides Soma and Edina I knew for sure they would pass I did not expect Takumi and Megumi to or at least not both of them to be able to get out but obviously that's what they want to do and I'm definitely excited to see where it's going to go from here. How are they going to get these seats? Who are they going to challenge everything? Obviously, there's one seat open considering Hayama is out. So that's kind of, I'm not too sure how that one's going to be filled and everything. But I'm definitely excited to see how all of that's going to go down. What are their plans going to be going in? And hopefully we get some pretty damn crazy, you know, battles between the Elite Ten and our final four members that of the Rebels that are still here. But... Yeah, that's all I really got to say, guys. Honestly, a pretty hyped up chapter, to say so myself. First part, like I said, honestly, seeing Edina, super adorable. Love that whole scene. Kind of got some Edina X Soma moments in there. After that, the craziness of Hayama being expelled. And then after that, it's not over yet. Roller coaster. It's choo choo train. Everyone's being expelled. The expelled train is coming through, and everyone gets expelled except, of course, Takumi and Megumi. Like I said, you know, obviously, it that was the only way they would be able to stay is because of Rindo. I knew that they couldn't win, but I knew that they could win because it's Rindo. Rindo would do something like this, and yeah, she ends up doing some crazy thing to which, of course, she ends up passing him. But yeah. I'm definitely excited to see where this is going to go, but yeah, that's all I got to say, guys. Hope you enjoyed this Anime Kino Manga review. If you have any questions, feel free to comment below this anti is and you want to talk about, comment below as well. Or if you just want to talk about what you are hyped up to see in the next chapters, what you expect to see in the next chapters and everything, how you felt about this chapter, how you felt about everyone being expelled except, obviously, Takumi and Megumi along with Edina and Soma. Feel free to comment below those kind of things. It's always interesting to see what you guys have to say as well about the chapter. But yeah, that's all I got to say, guys. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to like. If you haven't already, feel free to subscribe for more content. And yeah, that's all I got to say, guys. Until next time, see ya.